What's up, guys? Welcome to another episode of fucking Planet Scarf. Like my scarf? Shit's keeping my neck out. So it's so warm. Nah, welcome to the fucking Planet Hundo vlog, you know? I'm just out here at work. Working. Yeah, nah. Nah, and then I gotta leave here. I actually gotta leave here in like about an hour. I gotta leave work early and I gotta go start a new job. Cause I work outdoors here on a golf course, so in about three weeks, this ain't even gonna be happening no more. So I gotta fucking find some new shit. Get some new shit popping off, you know what I'm saying? Alright, I'll talk to you soon. I'll see you fucking in about an hour. <laughs> Holy shit! We fast forwarded way too far. This is the next day already. Same spot, same everything. It's just a little bit warmer. All right, let's go to the next clip. Just not, let's not skip so far. Jesus Christ. What does that look like to you? Lemonade? Because it's not. It's supposed to be orange juice. Do you think that that orange juice would taste any good? No, because it's literally just water and a microscopic amount of not even probably fructose. That is just a great example. Like if, if meat was put out on the shelf with that kind of visual appeal, people would throw a fucking fit. Like you would literally have people coming to the register going, do you guys know you have this on your shelf? Anyways. My point is, is fruits and vegetables are not give a fuck about. Like, there's no regulation for the quality of fruits and vegetables. But meat and dairy and everything else, oh, has to arrive a perfect certain way. And if it's not, it's not good and everyone has to know about it. But if fruits aren't good, then shut the fuck up. Doesn't matter. No. Fruits and vegetables need to be, have a standard and they need to be fucking perfect. This is bullshit. Oh, that was the price. It was called Check it out, Bri. So I get down right now. Looking good. All right. I don't know if what I'm watching is a natural grasshopper thing or if this is a fucking parasite literally like crawling out of this grasshopper's ass right now. What is going on? Do you see this? What is that? What the fuck is going on? I'm so disturbed right now. Oh my god. I think it's a fucking parasite. Can you turn a program? Can you turn a program? Can you turn a program? Just out here protesting the the circus. The Denver Coliseum. Anyways, it's pretty dark, so you can't really see me or hear me, but I'm out here. And I'm standing up for what's right. Animals are not slaves. All right, quick recap. What happened this week? Fucking went to work, went to work, went to work, went to work. Got a new job, went to work, went to work. Saw a fucking demon parasite grasshopper come out of a fucking grasshopper. Then I saw a fucking, uh, a lot of people go into the circus when I told them they shut in. God damn it! Hondo Wiggles for life, man. Planet Hondo. 
No doubt about it. Let me tell you all a little bit about my story. I'm gonna never let another guy come in and check my glory. So you can try me, stand me up in a crowd. And I will spend some wicked business, put you down and make my mama proud. So dumb, you need to get a blues clue. You had a mind that's bumpus, I've been my skin through.